okay now you are at level 2 you are going to understand project life cycle this is as important for a planning engineer to understand as you can see that a uh, complete framework is going to be explained in this category in this video that how whole industry is going to operate you understand either you talk about petrochemical industry either you talk about oil and gas industry plant shutdown construction industry they are going to follow this life cycle of project management so watch it and see you next level whenever you are going to talk about project management whatever i am going to share in next five minutes that is the basic concept okay what is the basic concept over here actually project management can be subdivided into five different kind of phases what are these phases the first phase is called initiate phase by name it is very obvious but simple si baat hai na. initiate what does it mean by initiate to start to initiate means to start this is the first phase okay so what we are supposed to do this initiate before init explaining initiate i will explain every as i told you earlier that project is actually a partnership between different kind of parties like uh, if i'm going to start a business i have i need uh, you know different kind of partners same this project is not possible without partnership of different kind of organization the first organization which is owner of this project is called client the advisor organization of this project who are expert people in technical skills in financial skills those people are called consultants and the people who are directly working on that project are called contractors or developers okay developers are thekedar are called contractors are called service companies okay so that's you can you have to understand that how it will go on okay so when story starts with initiate phase how it will you know start in initiate phase there is only one party client there is only one party client so client is going to hire consultant so as per the instructions of this client consultant is going to conduct certain kind of project report studies like first thing is feasibility study feasibility report this report either you can imagine up source sakte hai, about any project like your oil and gas project your refinery project your building construction project your city development project your world bank any campaign project so the first document will be like feasibility report like feasibility means financial analysis that either this project is going to give you benefit in terms of money and technically is it possible to build this project like i will give you an example if i am going to construct a road is that road is feasible to go through a city maybe in some cases i need to demolish many uh, you know buildings that is not feasible i i need to demolish very you know um, historical buildings and all that so that is not feasible i need to weigh out another way right so feasibility report is going to recommend that, that is the initiate phase how project is going to start actually feasibility report in that report you are going to take analysis about finances and technicalities simple at the end of feasibility report you are going to come up with two outcomes yes or no if your yes is there it means your project is going to aage chal raha hai iski saanse chalengi and you are going to compile project charter project charter now this is actually comprehensive document in which you are going to give you know green signal that my project is going to start there are specific deliverables that this building is going to be 10 stories this is going to be 2000 square feet area based building i am going to allot this much funding okay so how many people are going to be part of this you know this project ke kon kon se partners honge major life kind of information project charter okay that's done the first phase okay and the second phase is going to start when project charter is going to then the second phase is going to start that is called planning phase now in planning phase that is the second phase actually so now in the planning phase first of all 
you need to start design okay you have to produce design that building design road design petrochemical industry design then you need to make estimation documents like boqs how much like material requirement plans that how much cement you require how much steel you require how much how many piping you, you require for that project like estimation documents then you are going to make stand a contract okay contract document that on which conditions all these business partners all these project partners are going to deal with each other ye bhi to ho sakta na bhai kal ko kisi ki ladai ho jaye is that possible yes of course so we have to maintain that quality of project so we have to mention all those those conditions in that contract so contract is the document and via con then bidding process bidding documents like via bidding process we are going to award this project to some contractor thekedar service company developer do you understand bidding document or bidding stage or bidding process is required this client and consultant are mutually searching another party which is called thekedar developer or contractor to execute this project okay so now this project is awarded award of project done so new story starting over here this guy this guy is in the game now this guy will be part of game over here so after that within this planning phase is bande ki duty kya hai this guy is going to produce project schedule now you can relate it how project schedule will be compiled wo jo pichli slide please rewind yourself a few minutes back how that guy is going to produce this project schedule project management product management primavera p6 contract and agreement do you understand and this project schedule cash flow and uh, resource requirement and many other requirements uh, documents you can uh, produce aap nikal sakte ho primavera p6 se jo bhi aapko chahiye hota that is an another story no problem so now you understand what's going on now you now you understand what's going on here ye ye teenon parties ka samajh aa rahi hai pura main aapko samjha raha hu ke kaise oil and gas projects chalte hain okay now this planning phase the second phase and the third phase is going to start that phase is called execution phase it is practical phase practically your work is going to start what is going to happen the major leaders resources resource mobilization your all resources your crane your site engineer your chemical engineer civil engineer whatever staff you require to complete that project is going to move on site area you are going to set up your caravans you are going to set up your buildings over there temporary buildings temporary facilities we can say so that you can stay there and you can continue right so execution phase in execution phase your practical work is going to start over okay momin please don't make uh, lines over here thank you very much i i really appreciate your understanding thank you very much sometime i need to off disable this one okay thank you so execution work this is the third phase now during this third phase the fourth phase is going to start during this execution phase your fourth phase is going to start that is called monitor and control monitor and control in monitoring your staff like site engineers your uh, supervisors your foreman are going to monitor that what's going on on the site like uh, uh, you know welding is going on they are going to monitor they are going to document that information theek hai like uh, you know in our school days in our college days even in our university days there were monitors there were crs class representatives who are going to monitor all the class same there is a साइट रिप्रेजेंटेटिव साइट इंजीनियर होता है ठीक है ना दैट इज गोइंग टू डॉक्यूमेंट एवरीथिंग किसने कितना काम किया आज एक्सक्यूटर कितने आवर चला सो दैट इज मोनिटरिंग दैट गाइज एक्चुअली गोइंग टू डॉक्यूमेंट ईच एंड एवरीथिंग ऑन अ रजिस्टर आर एन एक्सेल शीट समथिंग लाइक दैट सो दैट गाय इज गोइंग टू शेयर डाटा विद प्लानिंग इंजीनियर ओके दैट गाय इज गोइंग टू शेयर दैट डॉक्यूमेंट विद प्लानिंग इंजीनियर नो प्लानिंग इंजीनियर इज गोइंग टू यूज दैट डाटा एंड गोइंग टू कंपेयर with this project schedule 
that guy planning engineer is going to use that data and going to compare with project schedule and going to produce progress reports so that is why this is called control because progress report ka kaam kya hota hai? what is the objective of progress report is to uh, you know measure performance ke bhai dekhna mera project ki performance kaisi hai so that would be called control karna project acha chal raha that's good project bura chal raha take some decision to control project simple so that is the fourth phase as long as our execution phase will be carried on hum jab tak execution phase karenge tab tak monitor control bhi karte rahenge and the last phase is called closing phase in closing phase you are going to uh, produce final report of your project handing over taking over at the end of this video i just want to highlight that if you want to learn this uh, full training full advanced level that how you can perform as a planning engineer in the industry of Gulf region, Saudi Arabia, Qatar, Oman, and uh, how you can pass job interviews. Because I know that watching these videos can leave you a lot of questions in your mind. So I am offering a live sessions uh, about construction industry planning and uh, plant shutdown industry planning and control. So I would like to invite you in my full interactive sessions. Enroll now.